you know, so many people were excited for La La Land to be out on DVD, so we can kind of relive all the award-winning magic. Well, Jim Ferguson was lucky <sighs> enough to sit down with actually several of the stars. Yes, I did. I talked to Emma, I talked to Ryan, and I talked to John Legend, yes. who we're going to have here Friday. But yeah, it's out now out on DVD Blu-ray. Yep. And anytime I can talk about one of my favorite films of the last five years, La La Land, I'm ecstatic about it. Oh, and, yeah. You know, Ryan Gosling, what a great job of dancing. And, of course, we all know he learned how to play the piano, yep. the jazz scenes, and he did, did that so well. He's probably, Tina, it's safe to say, one of the hottest sought-after actors in Hollywood today. I would agree with you. Yeah. You know, I loved him in Nice Guys. He does comedy. Yep. He directs. Uh, He's been nominated a couple times. Of course, he was nominated for La La Land. He didn't win, but he was at least he was nominated. Right now, he's in production for a science fiction movie called that Harrison Ford made years ago called Blade Runner. Oh, Blade Runner, yes. Yeah, he's, that's in production. Oh my gosh, what what a complete opposite flip flop. I know, of, from La La Land, yeah. right. So let's go to my interview with Ryan Gosling, nominated Oscar for Best Actor for La La Land. Wow. Ryan, congratulations. What a wonderful film. Oh. Your performance was outstanding. Thank you very much. Glad you, you know, liked it. Oh, I, yeah, I did. Um, I shouldn't say this, you know, because I do a, an Oscar picks, but it's Oscar Bob, without a doubt, in my opinion. And That's... most of my friends, too. Um, you know, it's set in Los Angeles, where we're doing this interview, and it's La La Land agree that the city itself is really an important character in this film, in this musical. Mm -hmm. It's true, yeah. Um, I've been here since I was 16 and uh, um, it was great to be able to shoot in some of these iconic locations and uh, you know also some places that uh, that are quintessentially LA but also you don't get to see in film very often mm -hmm. so you know I know LA pretty well and it was fun kind of picking out the places that you recognize you know yeah did you have any doubts as a, you know we talked nice guys not too long ago you you, you have a great range as an actor uh, about playing a song and dance man well sure it was uh it's definitely was a, a challenge but I think that the uh, you know it was a great challenge and it was really worth a shot because it's such a uh, felt like such a special film and opportunity mm. that uh, um, and we had such a great team of coaches around us at all times that it was just like this uh, endless wind of goodwill at your back through the whole experience. You know what I found amazing? Uh, there's a shot where you have your hands on the piano, then they pull back so we know it's you playing the piano. Right. That you learned to grasp how to play a piano in that short time. Um, and I just thought it was amazing. And I'm sure that you have a real appreciation now for jazz. I do. Uh, I, uh, you know, I always wanted to play piano, but it's not something I really ever had time to pursue. Mm -hmm. So. It was a great opportunity to get to, you know, spend three months just uh, uh, practicing and, and getting to practice such great pieces. Some were jazz pieces and some were, uh, you know, part of the original score. But uh, Damien, the director, wanted to shoot all of those scenes in one shot without any trick photography. So it was crucial that I, I, I learned how to play them. So it was... Uh, was a good kind of pressure. You do such a great job. Thank you. Quick comment on Dancing with Emma Stone. Yes. You liked it. <laughs> yeah, it was, uh, we were very lucky that we had made two films together beforehand. Yeah, yeah. Because there was a lot to learn and to do in this film, so we were able to just hit the ground running. You actually said that he's kind of shy. In yeah, person. he is. And you can tell pretty much yeah. from the interview, yeah, that he's, not really outward, you know. He's getting better with interviews, though. He, when he first started, you know, he was really extremely shy. You know, Aww. he's much better now. A lot of actors are that way. Well, that's very yeah. kind of endearing about him. You, yeah, you know, yeah, he's, he's, he's kind of like a sex symbol for some, you know, women, and to kind of know he's kind of shy. I think that's a learning. I just say Ryan is a hardworking actor. He really works at his craft. Yeah, no matter what he does. Well, yeah. speaking of people that work at their craft, who wow. we're hearing from on Friday, same thing. John Legend, mm -hmm. 10 Grammy Award winner, 10 time Grammy, yeah. songwriter, uh, singer, and uh, he has a good role. It's his first role in La La Land. 
uh, and he gets to p sing and play his and play the instruments. And uh, yeah, it's a fun interview with John Legend. His name is so appropriate, isn't it? Absolutely. He's become a legend in the music world. We will hear from him on Friday. On Friday. Yeah. Yes. All right. Even to get more of Jim's celebrity interviews, though, visit TucsonMorningBlend.com and search for Hollywood happenings.